number 3 example number 1 when two steel flats of same thickness 200 mm into 10 mm sides are connected at their ends by 8 mm size of the weld at site if the ultimate shear stress is 200 newton per mm square find the tensile stress in the flat so let us sketch the diagram for this or figure for this so two flats of same thickness so one is 200 mm this is 200 mm length down also 200 mm of thickness both are of thickness 10 mm which are connected by using fillet well of size 8 mm so this is the size 8 mm so the welding will be done here again the welding will be done yeah with the size 8 mm on the both the sides this is l1 this is also l and this length is 200 mm length is 200 mm step 1 or given data so what is given here size of the plates so s is equal to 200 into 10 mm and the ends are connected to a plate by size of weld so size of the weld size of this is size of the plate and size of the weld size of the weld smallest that is 8 is greater than 3 mm yes it is valid next ultimate shear stress that is F u is equal to 200 Newton per mm square. See in this question the welding is done at site. So the partial safety factor changes that is 1.50 for the step 2 size of the well yes it is 8 mm greater than or equal to 3 mm let us check 8 mm is greater than 3 mm hence it is valid. Step 3 total length of the well sorry total length before finding effective length we must find the total length. So we know the total length is 200 mm. So 200 mm effective length. L minus 2 into S that is 200 minus 2 into 8 that is 200 minus 16 I guess it is 184 200 16 4 9 8 yes 184 mm so the effective length is 184 mm step 3 this is step 2 step 3 ultimate shear stress that is f u 200 newton per mm square step 4 is design stress that is f w d is equal to f u by root 3 into 1.50 because the welding is done at site. So 200 by root 3 into 1.50 so let us check the answer what is the answer for the design tensile strength yes. so two hundred divided by root three into one point five zero 
So the answer is 76.98. 76.98 Newton per mm square. The next step is we need to find design strength in the weld. We need to find design strength that is step 5. We need to find design strength. Step 5. Design strength the well formula is pd is equal to 0 0.7 into size of the well into l effective length into design ultimate design stress that is fwd so 0 0.7 into size of the well 8 effective length is 184 effective length is 184 the design shear stress is 76.98 uh, 76.98 78 so 0 0.7 into 8 into 184 into 76.98 that is divided with 10 power 3 79.28 approximately we can take up to 80 kilo newtons but we need to find uh, what you have to find this question that tensile stress in the flat that is step 6 tensile stress in the flat that is T T is equal to 2 times of the design strength in the weld by area of the plate that is 2 into 80 into 10 power 3 divided by 200 into 10 area of the plate. So, we are going to get let us check the answer 2 into 80 into 10 power 3 divided by 200 into 10. So, 80 Newton per mm square is the answer. So, this is a design tensile stress in the well and this is design strength in the well. This is for the flats, this is for the flats, this is for the well. So, this is design strength of the well, whereas this is design tensile stress in the flat. So, this is the answer for, for the given question.